What's up, everybody? I'm Derek Game, and welcome back to the channel. Today, today, we're back with some more Monster Hunter. And just today, we're looking at the new Rajang armor pieces. And this is pretty beasty because this is the long sword. Actually, this long sword is pretty damn good. It has Thunder 270, 50% affinity, which is surprisingly good. I thought they were going to do it dirty by doing like negative 20 affinity. But look at that purple sharpness. You literally don't need anything on it. I guess this is great because it's kind of like. I what else off a jiva set you have to do like sharpness two levels of sharpness level five but this just has straight off purple sharpness it's like wow that's really really good so you don't need handicraft and master's touch is even debatable because that's a good amount to go without having to actually switch your sharpen your weapon so that might be the new non-meta safa jiva armor piece but also too the damage is pretty good 570 557 for attack I'm liking it. I'm liking it a lot. Let me see what the gray. I guess we'll go through all the weapons, see what they all look like. Because I'm pretty sure what everybody's going to be excited to see what they all look like. All right. This is the gray sword. Similar. The only thing I don't like with the long sword, I don't like the design too much. But hey, the gray sword, pretty good damage. All that purple sharpness as well. 1344 attack, which is pretty good. And you can still upgrade it as well. I haven't gotten the guidelines upgraded, but we're just going to go through and see what all the, style, the styles look like. This is design of sword and shield. Pretty nice. 300 thunder the hammer so that are the weapons i'm liking a lot i'm really really liking the weapons looks the same style as the other one nice 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 let's switch out look like they kept the same styles yeah so it spices them up a lot oh i like the way that one looks demon lord's fist the hunting horn lovely there's a gun lance charge blade yeah these are these these stats are looking really really good like bow gun and last but not least here we go the bow so now let's check out the armor now this is what we're waiting for is it gonna break the meta so we'll start with the alpha set stuff first earplugs three plus rogues three but no slots on it damn pull them all out so that's okay that's pretty cool maximum might they're really trying to bring the skill back by having three levels of it already let me see what the set bonus is so I guess we'll just put it on and we'll see what it looks like. Damn, that thing looks super, super beefy. So, maximum my secret. Razor's max level, maximum might. And this next one is maximum level, amazing maximum level of heroic skill. So, increase attack, increase attack by 40%, increase defense by 150 points. Cool, cool, not bad at all. Maximum might, increase affinity by 40% as soon as stamina gauges. This is pretty good. Not bad at all. Looks like they got rid of the whole like mind's eye effect he had on himself though. But yeah, that set is super beefy. The next one, stamina surge, defense boost. Okay, this is really like a defensive build. This high damage. Ooh. Health boost level three all the way maxed up and two slots. So the slots right now, this was okay. Alpha, alpha says never really have good slottage. It's really going to be about the beta says. Now check out the beta and see how it looks. So headpiece comes with four, the one level four, earplugs and heroic. Okay, if you use earplugs, that's the way to go because very, very efficient. Three levels of it. Maximum might and four and two. Mm, if you're going for maximum might build and that, I can see that being useful. If not, it's okay. Next, stamina surge. And four, two, one. So the slaughter is good. Sam ministers, you want to run that, it's worth your while. Next is maximum my two levels. Hmm. Four, two, one as well. So you have a lot of decoration slots by having this set. And the last one, ooh, two level fours and hell boost level four, level three. Damn, this might be good. This, this might be good. Yeah. Matter of fact, this, I think this might be good. Let me see this. Let's play around with something real quick. Let's go ahead and make the pants. So I don't need vitality. I don't need vitality. No levels I have on. Okay. That's all my vitality jewels. Yeah. Nothing else to give me vitality is making sure. Yep. 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 Help boost, help boost, help boost. Level three already maxed out. So now what am I missing? Critical eye. So I was like, is it worth it? Critical eye, I'm missing critical eye and critical boost. 
So essentially, it's just gonna allow me to do like something like this. Let's see, I'd probably just put evasion. Critical evasion, get that one. I need one more level. So, I will need. And that's with me already having the master's charm on. To have that. Now, am I worse off or better off? So, the only thing I lost was two levels of critical eye, which I could put this on to get that back. And I gained two levels of evasion. But, like, it's, it's negligible. And I could put, like, I don't know, put, like, medicine jewel here because I have everything else I need. So, I mean, it gives you more options. Let's see. Yeah, I can put a maintenance set here. Oh, but I am worse off because I can't have P performance on it. I don't have, uh, yeah, I don't, I don't have P performance on the set anymore. So, I'll play around with some more. But the, I feel that like the legs can be useful. Because it has health boost three and two level four slot, I think we can work with that. Everything else in the set is like, it's cool. I haven't really spent too much time with Maximum Mind, so. I can't really say what I'm going to do there with it, but I always go for beta sets too. I'm liking the slottage though. If I get rid of master's touch, because if I get with, with this weapon, those weapons have so much purple sharpness that you don't need master's touch. And that's I'm all about like making sets outside of master's touch. So not bad. So comment below what you guys think about the armor. What are your, what are your thoughts about it? You guys think is it enough to break out the meta? What pieces are you actually going to use in your set? And we're going to have a conversation about it as well. Everybody, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. New channel, subscribe, like, and give a thumbs up. Till next time, dear gamers, signing out.